Hi, I'm Carl with Apt, and this is the brand new GoPro Hero. It's essentially the replacement for the Hero 5 Session 4K camera, and while it's not 4K itself, it does offer a great user experience and captures video and 10 megapixel stills very well. And we have them in stock to order right here at Apt in Glenview or online at Apt.com. We'll start off by touching on the design a little bit. It's identical to the Hero 6 Black, other than it doesn't say 6 anywhere, but the battery location, record button, and multifunction button are all in the exact same location. So if you have accessories for your Hero 6 Black already and you purchase the Hero for yourself or someone else in your family, you're in good shape for sharing most of your accessories, assuming you want to share them. So to sum that up, I really like the design of the Hero 6 and I like the design of the Hero. It's durable, small, and easy to operate. As for features, this one has plenty to get someone who's new to action cameras or just looking to get a new action camera ready to shoot some enjoyable footage. There's two recording options, you get 1440p or 1080p, and both can be shot in either 30 or 60 frames per second. Now at 1080p, you can also choose from wide, medium, and narrow, where 1440 only offers wide angle shooting. And all the settings offer image stabilization, which worked well. It does punch in on the video by about 10% when you have it turned on, but it makes the videos much easier to watch. We made a demo of how the image stabilization works that you can also check out. It's waterproof down to 33 feet and it offers voice control, however it doesn't have the wake on voice function. It automatically adjusts to low light surroundings and low light video came out well for a $200 camera. It's not quite as detailed in the bright and dark as the Hero 6 Black, but the Hero is half the price. This one's missing an audio input for a mic as well, but the audio captured through the camera itself was decent and it records in stereo too. It also has a micro HDMI out, which was missing from the Hero 5 session, the camera it's really designed to replace, so you can run the videos right from the camera to your TV. You also have time-lapse recording built in, and it's offered in half-second increments for both photos and videos. And if you ever find your battery running low, this also works with GoPro's supercharger accessory, which will charge the battery up to 20-70% to 70 faster than the normal charger. So overall, for an entry-level action camera, we found this to perform really well, and having the touchscreen interface made it simple to set up and use. All that, coupled with a removable battery, makes this a good camera for the budget-minded adventurer to consider. As always, we appreciate you checking out our videos and make sure to subscribe so you get updates every time we post new content.